Hi everyone, welcome to Nomaden Berlin's guide to the best free online bank in Germany. In recent years, the personal banking sector has experienced a complete shake-up by the arrival of slick new challenger banks operating entirely online. Depending on where you are from, you may have already had experience with digital banking through the likes of Monzo, Revolut, Wise, formerly known as TransferWise, or Bunk, amongst others. But when it comes to digital banking in Germany, there are two clear frontrunners in my opinion. These are N26 and Vivid Money. In this video, I'll be explaining exactly why these are two of the best banking options in Germany, before looking at what differentiates the two to help you select the right one for you. If you'd like further info on banking in Germany, head down to the description below where I've linked in a bunch of related resources as well as some sign up links for N26 and Vivid. Just click on the sign up links to initiate the online sign up process for either bank and get registered in a few short minutes. While down in the description, hit the like and subscribe buttons if you find the information in this video helpful and would like to support the channel. So back to banking in Germany. Here we're going to jump right in and look at why N26 and Vivid are two great digital banking options for newcomers to Germany, especially compared with the large bricks and mortar famous financial institutions such as Deutsche Bank, Commerzbank and Sparkasse. The first criteria in which N26 and Vivid Money distinguish themselves is that their standard accounts are 100% free to set up and maintain. With the majority of German banks costing between 5 and 10 euros a month, it's definitely an added bonus to know that your hard-earned money is not being chipped away at by pesky account fees. Continuing on the topic of fees, N26 and Vivid also offer free ATM withdrawals. For N26, this amounts to 3 to 5 free ATM withdrawals per month, while Vivid offers 200 euros per month in free withdrawals. While free ATM withdrawals is something that you may be accustomed to in your home country, this is quite uncommon for German banks. For example, if you opt to open a bank account with Sparkasse, you'll only get free ATM withdrawals if withdrawing money from a Sparkasse ATM. At any other ATM, you'll incur around a 7 euro fee. The situation is similar with Deutsche Bank. You'll only receive free ATM withdrawals from Deutsche Bank ATMs or ATMs within their network. At any other ATM, you'll incur around a six euro fee. These ATM fees stack up in no time, although they are easily avoided by opting for an online bank such as Vivid or N26, which as mentioned, offer free ATM withdrawals. So far, we've established that Vivid and N26 are far more economical than the standard German high street banks. Another area where they really differentiate from traditional German retail banks is when it comes to expat friendliness. When it comes to your finances, it's important that you know exactly what's going on. Not being able to communicate about a banking issue can be seriously stressful and worrying. Thankfully, both N26 and Vivid offer all their products, services, apps and support in English. This ensures you can understand your finances completely and also receive the support you need in a language you understand 24 hours a day. On top of their English speaking support and services, you will also benefit from the fact that both Vivid and N26 are tech focused young startups. Their banking services are all managed through sleek and intuitive mobile apps which combine great design with smooth functionality. Both banks offer a customer friendly user experience allowing you to manage all your finances online with relative ease while living in Germany. In my opinion, the online usability of these apps more than makes up for the lack of in-branch support. While other German high street banks have online functionality, more often than not, these are clunky German portals that are difficult to navigate. This pales in comparison to N26 and Vivid, which allow you to complete most of your banking services with just a few clicks on their respective apps. A fifth and final shared benefit of N26 and Vivid is that they both have an easy online sign-up process. To start the process, click on the sign-up links in the description below and follow the instructions. Once you've completed the initial sign-up steps, you'll complete a quick video verification call where you'll be taken through some security procedures, after which your bank card will be delivered after approximately one week. Importantly, your N26 or Vivid bank card can be delivered to any address that you choose in Germany. This does not need to be an official registered address, which you can only obtain through completing the unmelding process in Germany. This is particularly useful for newcomers to Germany, 
who want to open a German bank account but do not have an official registered address yet. The online sign-up process offered by N26 and Vivid is significantly easier than the process offered by traditional retail banks in Germany that require you to sign up in a branch. In almost all cases, traditional high street banks also require that you show an unmelding certificate and you'll likely be prevented from opening an account until you can prove you have an official registered address. So far, we've covered a raft of benefits offered by both N26 and Vivid. They're both great options and offer a largely similar product and service. However, while similar, they offer a number of features that may sway you one way or the other. Firstly, let's take a closer look at N26's standout features. The first of these features is MoneyBeam. This is my favourite feature allowing you to instantly send money to other N26 account holders. You don't even need their bank details, just their mobile number. As the transfers are instant, it's a great way of quickly repaying friends after a meal or holiday, and obviously much quicker than making an international or domestic transfer. The second feature that I love about N26 is its partnership and integration with WISE, formerly known as TransferWISE. This allows you to send money overseas at the real market exchange rate all within the N26 app, with a full overview of any charges you'll incur. The third feature on the N26 list is budgeting tools. Here you have push notifications, which give you clear real-time data on what you are spending and when, whether this is a card payment, ATM withdrawal, direct debit or bank transfer. N26 statistics, which is an in-app analytics feature that allows you to analyze how you are spending over time. And N26 spaces, which allows you to create sub-accounts within your main account. This helps compartmentalize your money for better, clearer budgeting. When you combine these features with the fact that N26 offers a free account, multilingual customer support, and slick online functionality, it's easy to see why they are such a popular choice of bank amongst newcomers to Germany. But despite what you may read, N26 is not the be-all and end-all when it comes to online banks in Germany. In fact, when comparing N26's features with Vivid, my preference actually falls on the side of Vivid. The first standout feature of Vivid is Money Pockets which allow you to split your money into 15 free sub-accounts. A real nifty feature of Vivid's Money Pockets is that you can add different currencies to different sub-accounts, which effectively transforms your account into a multi-currency account. Better still, when freely moving currencies between Money Pockets, you will be offered a live exchange rate and no exchange limits. When overseas and paying in a foreign currency, the funds will automatically be drawn from the suitable Money Pocket and you'll incur no fees for payments made globally. This is a fantastic feature if you are someone who travels a lot and often makes payments in foreign currencies. On top of this, Vivid also have an extensive cashback program. On paper, this program looks to be a winner, giving you up to 10% cashback at some popular companies and brands including Leverandu, Reva and HelloFresh, as well as subscription services such as Netflix and Amazon Prime Video. There are also other earning features that come with a Vivid account. For example, they have integrated trading and investment functionality into their app. This will allow you to use the Vivid app to invest in US and EU stocks or ETFs, either commission-free or at a very low cost. If you've always been intimidated by investment platforms and high trading commissions, then Vivid may be a great starting point for building a personal investment portfolio, including some of the biggest companies in the world. Vivid is undoubtedly one of the most modern banking solutions on the market. This is further exemplified by the company's recent entry into the cryptocurrency sphere. Through your Vivid account, you can now invest in cryptocurrency, including all the major coins such as Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, etc. While Vivid offers some attractive earning features, they also don't compromise when it comes to security. One thing I particularly like is that Vivid offers a free, extra secure Visa debit card with every account. Vivid cards have no personal data on them. No card number, no expiration date, no CVV security code, absolutely nothing. All this info can be found in the app, meaning your account is fully secured in the event that you lose your card. Your account can also be instantly frozen and unfrozen in the Vivid app which is a wide range of integrated login protection technologies, such as fingerprint and face recognition, etc. You'll also receive notifications of any account activity, giving you a full overview of funds coming out and in of your account. 
All in all, I see N26 and Vivid as the future of online personal banking in Germany. As they continue to grow their market share and expand across Europe, they'll undoubtedly continue to improve their features, functions and usability. I hope you found this video to be a helpful overview of N26 and Vivid. As mentioned earlier, check out the description below for more banking tips and resources if you are still undecided. Any questions, drop a comment below.